Custer became the youngest NASCAR driver in history to compete in the Camping Outdoor Truck Series and has enjoyed two unbelievably successful seasons in Xfinity Series racing since starting full-time in 2017. After being promoted to Stuart Haas Racing's Cup Series program in 2020, Cole Custer took the sport by storm, becoming the first rookie to win a Cup Series race in four years. In this video, we're going to discuss Cole Custer is totally done with NASCAR. The video is going to be amazing, so make sure you stick to the end. On November 15, 2019, Stuart Haas Racing announced that Custer will replace Daniel Suarez in the number 41 Ford in 2020. He scored his first Cup top 10 finish at Phoenix, while his maiden top 5 came at Indianapolis. A week after Indianapolis, Custer won his first Cup race in the Quarter State 400 at Kentucky Speedway, passing Kevin Harvick, Martin True Jr. and Ryan Blaney on the last lap. He became the first rookie to win in the Cup Series since Chris Boucher in 2016, the first rookie to do so in a non-shortened race since Juan Pablo Montoya in 2007, and the 33rd driver to win a race in all the three NASCAR National Touring Series. With the win, Custer made the 2020 playoffs but was eliminated following the third round at Bristol. Custer remained with Stuart Haas for the 2021 season. However, his results were inconsistent and he finished the playoffs after the regular season finale at Daytona, as he was 26th in the point standings, with just two top 10s in Talladega and Dover. In 2017, as an Xfinity Series rookie, Custer won the final race of the season at Homestead Miami Speedway. Leading for 182 laps, Custer set a record for the most laps led in a single NASCAR Xfinity Series race at Homestead while driving away from his competition to win by an unbelievable 15.405 seconds. The win capped off an impressive year with 7 top 5 and 19 top 10 finishes. Cole Custer has been a part of SHR since 2017 and we're glad he's staying with us, Stewart said in a team statement. Cole's experience will be invaluable to Riley Herbst as he continues his development on the Xfinity series. Stuart Haas Racing announced that Brace would take over the number 41 car in 2023. He'll replace Cole Custer as Custer drops down to the Xfinity Series to run a second car for the team. Brace, 32, raced part-time across all three of NASCAR's top three series in 2022, after three seasons in the Cup Series. Brace steadily worked his way up the NASCAR leaderboard after rising to stardom in the Welland Modified Tour. In 2016, he joined the Xfinity Series full-time at JD Motorsports. Disappointed when he was racing in the middle of the field, he took whatever sponsorship money he had and brought it to Joe Gibbs Racing in 2017 and 2018. He won again at Bristol in 2018 and moved up to the Cup Series the following season. Paris made two Cup Series starts and three Xfinity Series starts in 2022. He made 10 Truck Series starts and won at Nashville for the second consecutive season. Priest has 7 top 5s and 9 top 10s in those 10 truck starts. From 2019 to 2021, Priest managed the entire Cup Series schedule for JTG Doherty Racing, owned by former NBA player Brad Doherty. He had some bright moments, but the underfunded second car for the small team couldn't give him a chance to drive wins. In 2022, Priest had 1 truck win and 11 top 10s in 10 truck starts and 3 Xfinity starts. Brees appeared likely to replace Eric Almirola, who announced he was retiring after 2022. However, his position shift after Almirola forewent his retirement and co-owner Tony Stewart vouched for Brees as Custer struggled. Ryan has backed himself a few times in his career and it's always paid off. Now we're betting on him, Stewart said of adding Brees to the lineup. Now Ryan has the right opportunity in the cup. We're proud to have him and looking forward to seeing what he can do in our racing cars. Custer will return to the NASCAR Xfinity Series in a second car for SHR, who already fields an entry for Riley Herbst. Custer has 10 wins in the series, including one he earned in 2022 at Auto Club Speedway with SS Greenlight Racing. Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. This was all for today, hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, stay safe and we'll be back soon with another video.